Holy shit, guys. Welcome to another video of Cyberpunk 2077. I mean, we're now going to be starting Act 2. Act 1 was awesome. There's a lot of things that happened that I was not expecting at all. Uh, comment below if you were expecting things just such as, you know, spoiler alert, Jackie dying or, you know, all that stuff that went down last act. So uh, comment below if you were thinking it was going to happen or not. Maybe you kind of knew the storyline before me, but uh, I was not expecting any of that, which is crazy. Uh, I guess before we get started Act 2, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe button, and the notification button uh, so you get alerted when the next episodes are available. Uh, so let's get back to the storyline. Act 2, baby. <clears throat> Mr. B, I would like to inform you that Mr. Wells' body has been delivered to his family. Damn. Starting off with a sad message. Still before we continue, to try to save the game. Alright. So, we did level up, so let's do that. I actually want to engine when looting drones, mech bots, there's 24% looting weapon mod or attachment. I like that. Grants immunity wall effects in your from your own grenades. I like that too. Can you throw a grenade, just run in there. <laughs> That'd be pretty Reduces damage taken from explosions by 10%. Not bad. Explosions radius of grenades is is visible. Oh, that's pretty neat actually. But I think I'm gonna go with it. You can do three. Huh? I think I'm gonna go ahead and. I think I'm gonna do one more here in. I think I'm gonna build here. Why technical ability? Because I want to be building more stuff. And I think since we're back at, you know, at the beginning or not at the beginning, but in our apartment, I feel like it'll be a good skill to have. One of one, one of one. One of one allows you to craft rare items. Yeah. And I think we're stuck here until level nine, seven. This is seven. Well, they're going to have a 5% chance of getting a free component of the same quality. Okay, that's pretty cool. 9, 12, 11. Okay, I don't want to mess with the Granadas right now. What's over here? Health regen up to 70% maximum outside of the combat, which is not bad. Get health increase. Where is level 20? Fall damage. See, I don't, I don't like fall damage. Shotguns. I'm not a big shotgun user or a fist user. I'm more of an assault slash handguns. I think pistols are good because then that's, that's where I can have like two a submachine gun, assault rifle, and then a pistol. I can go ahead and swap it out whenever I'm in combat. I need to reload. Instead of reloading, I just swap it out. So, ring kills. Use the rifle and submachine gun's damage while aiming down by 10%. I do aim down a lot, <clears throat> so I'm gonna take that. That'll be good. 12, so. I'm definitely going to try to do the assault, finish up the assault, and finish up the... Oh, look at this, you get, uh, you guys seen this? Uh, kind of, right, my camera's a little bit there, but... So, at level skill progression reward, so at level 2, you, re you reduce the ADS time on submachine guns and rifle time by 20%. Level 3, you get a perk point. Level four reduces your recoil with submachine guns and rifle types by 10%. So all of these, even like the assault, the more you use the assault, the more uh, rewards you get. All the way up to awesome. What about my character? Oh no. Wait, why am I naked? Hold on. Yeah. Bulletproof. 
Oh, but isn't it heavy though? Am I gonna slow down? Increase good damage by 30%. That's actually really good. Oh, it has a mod on it. Put some uh, most armor, so I'll put that one on there. Legs, good. Team. Look kind of weird, but armor. No hat. Face. Glasses. Gives me armor. Are you serious? Damn, dude, look at that swag. Yeah, no class. Bandage wrapping? There are times when it really doesn't matter how you look. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Guns. Is that the rare iconic one? What? And a full rifle. Wow, that pistol has more DPS and that's crazy actually. Care about what I'm gonna do a submachine here. You know what? Right. I'm gonna do the submachine. I might do these here. Pistol, submachine gun, assault rifle. Alright. <clears throat> Actually, before we start. I guess... I guess one thing we could do is we can go ahead and do some side jobs now, huh? I mean, we're... I think... Starting in Act 2. Uh, I guess we'll keep going on in Act 2. We'll make a separate video for, um, for the side quest. You know what I'm saying, guys? Keep it strictly like, for land. Now, let's hear what the Rubicons have to say about it. Sashebra here. We must meet. Come to Thomas Diner. Yeah, what would hmm. Why would I do that? Come on, brother. Because I am the one who saved your life. Oh, really? I haven't managed to get my head straight yet. Not after everything that happened. That will not happen anytime soon. And so what? If you intend to leave, you must re-enter the ring. The bell has already told. Thomas Diner, I am waiting. Okay. Ugh. Relic my function detected. Mega build mission administration. Message. Read the message from okay. Here's become a great reality check, okay? The best weapon against capitalism is uninterrupted meditation. Mega Building H10 administration informs you that your vehicle is available for collection in a nearby parking garage. We wish you a pleasant day. That kind of need that. Nina Jones. Big type. The object. Where do you see? No, I don't want to track that. J for journal. One, two. Here we 
gotta find my car. NCPD. Let's continue. Okay. Okay. Next. We begin now with your latest local news. Also, if you guys know how to unwield weapons, please comment below. I feel like I should know how to do this, but I don't. I just realized there's nothing in my act. anything on my ex. Do I have no more health packs? So that's gonna suck. Not that I did them. And closest associate, Weldon Holt. Holt has also announced plans to run for mayor in the election. Today, we all mourn the untimely loss of our mayor. Guitar pick. Think of my car. What's this one? Oh, this is just a cell. Oh, okay, okay, okay. You know what? I think I'm gonna just sell everything except for that because that's what iconic on Very iconic. Oh, I don't want to sell that. Oh, wait, 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 hold on. I have. I have too many pistols on. The same thing. That car, give me some good car, bro. Assuming I can buy and sell car things. Vehicles buying. There we go. If Fixer just sent you an offer to buy a vehicle, whenever you give an offer, and you make it appear in the minimap to buy the vehicle, go to indicator. Oh yes, dude. Right. This guy first. Then we'll do some side quests. I feel like I want to start doing some side quests. Gotta get the ride. Sit. Sit. Uh, you do not look so bad. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. Oh, yeah? You underestimated me. Actually, I want to see why. Why'd you help me anyway? I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. This is about the biochip? 
that why I'm here? Probably. Hmm. I hear it's damaged beyond repair. Any attempt to extract it would be disastrous. Fatal for you. Vic likes to talk, I guess. Not many could do what he did. You should be thankful. I am, bro. What's it you actually want from me? Yeah, bro. Spit it out. To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and the Yorino Barasaka had an intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. I'm thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. <laughs> She's likely gone very far away. Why you figure she skipped town? I tried to locate her, but had no success. I suspect she covered her trunks. You said Parker could help you remove the relic. Does she work for a corporation? Mm, yeah, I have no idea. Got no clue. Everyone was knowledgeable about the relic. Had a large chunk of classified info. An enigma to be sure. But she showed that slime as he getting corpo agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slime as you speak of. <laughs> you got tossed out, lumped with the outcasts, easily. Or have you forgotten? Hmm. Sorry I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose, so... Hey, wait. Oh, shit. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. Looking for justice in Night City. I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. Okay. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think... They'll trust the word of a merc. I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. You are hunted, brother. What if I say no? Then I will tell you what rewards await if you help me. So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. Huh? It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. Yep. Politics. Exactly what kind of people are we talking about? People who hold Arasaka dear. Ah, it's hot. People interested in the corporation's stable growth. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist, thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true, he's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka, betrayed it. Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you. Fucking Saka scums everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you <laughs> say? You oh. heard me. Let it go, Takamura. Hmm. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. Would've been bad if I didn't click that. Yeah. 
Thanks for the offer. I need to think about it. I'll get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place, the club called the Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the queen of fixers there, Rogue. She take you for a suit? <laughs> no, she saw me as Saburo-sama's killer. Rogue's well informed, gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. Dolma is choosy, expensive, and rude. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she would not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes, I thought it ironic. Thieves have that. There's just honor, I believe. Your noble Arasaka would agree, I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Helma, whoever. I must see some friends. Call in some favors. You see that? He just when appeared my and then walked away. Listen, what the fuck? I will call you. That was, so then, I guess. <laughs> that was fucking funny. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Okay. Whoa. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Our Sok is still a despotic machine and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you got some nerve. First you had to kill me, now you want to be my pal. Make like nothing happened. You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dickwipe. <laughs> Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. I don't trust you, bro. Why should I trust you? Remind me again. Trust me, don't trust me. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> it's the least of our worries, anyway. Okay. You're the ghost of Chris's past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know, Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. <laughs> Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seeing your memories, gross. 
Rogue will dance to any tune I play, or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. All right. Get to I want to go with Evelyn first here. All right, guys, I think that's it for this video. Uh, we just started Act Two. We got uh, we were aware there's a lot of stuff going on around the city. So I think as I continue in Act 2, maybe even finish Act 2, I might gonna go ahead and make some more videos of uh, side quests and kind of go through those um, in separate videos and just keep a main video for the overall walkthrough on the main. Or maybe not. I'll think about it. But anyways, hit that like button, subscribe button, notification button, and then I'll see you guys next time. Peace.